Damn, I didn't even realize I went into 12 minutes. One of my last jobs, uh... One of my last jobs, I had to chop up uh, bacon for wedge salad. Uh, make, uh, for my chopping skills, uh, crumble up the bacon real, real teeny pieces for chopping with a chef knife. But uh, and then I've, I've chopped up other things in kitchens, um, chopped celery, uh, tomatoes in little pieces using a chef knife. But as far as like this goes, it was just b b mostly bacon. Uh, I think I had to do apples too for Apple Brown Betty, the dessert. But I might, I don't know. I used to be a chef apprentice. Uh, yeah, I worked under a chef. Uh, been, it's been a while. Worked in 14 different restaurants. Um, well, about 15, 14. Uh, even though I was a dishwasher, I was a sud boy, pots and pans, but I still have experience uh, cooking, prepping. Doing salads, being on the cold um, relish uh, salad station, I got I got experience. Motherfuckers, I got soup, sauce, relish, dressing. I got some experience on my belt. I used to make chili and put cinnamon sticks in the chili. I used to make marinara sauce, Alfredo sauce, pizza, homemade. Man, you name it. Made made um. I used to make uh, car garden salads, uh, wedge salads, uh, fried French fries, uh, fried chicken, fried taco salad, you name it. I've been there. I've done it. I've done it. I've done it. Clean kitchens from, from the bottom to the top, being on ladders, scrubbing the ceilings and shit, uh, cleaning ovens, cleaning deep fryers. So I've done just about everything in the kitchen. Except computers and accounting. I even put stock away, put put applesauce away, apricots away. I put um, what else? Let's see, chili sauce away, spaghetti sauce away, uh, big things of olives. Um, what else? Uh, prunes. Shit. Put uh, uh, what do they call that? Um, uh, fuck, uh, they call that shit. Ah, uh, uh, my mind is my mind is fogged up. I mean, I got brain fart. I don't know. Shit, I can't think straight right now. I'm just trying to finish this right now. I'm about to finish this right now. <coughs> Some of that. Uh, I had a little bit of Four Loco before. I ain't never drinking that shit again. Fuck Four Loco. The only way I'll ever drink that is if a dominatrix or a hot mistress or a dominatrix forces me to drink it. Calls me a damn loser. Turning me on at the same time. It's the only way I'd drink that shit. Other than that, I ain't fucking with that shit anymore. Four Loco can kiss my ass. That shit's, man. I don't know how people buy that shit. For real, I don't know. I don't know, but I like this. I really, I really like this though. This actually is pretty good. And I'm hard to please. I'm very picky. Actually, it was pretty good. I just finished it. it took me about 15, 14 minutes. 4.7% ABV. Um, this was a pint, six fluid ounces, 650 milliliters. Um, this is uh, clocking out of. Um, um, I like how they say in the UFC. I just forgot how they say it. Um, representing um, Larkspore, California. Fuck yeah, flying horse. Now I spent like eight bucks on a six pack of this today, and then I seen they have the Jameson um, four cans for like thirteen dollars. One place was like sixteen bucks for four cans. <laughs> Damn. 
I do kind of like Jameson, but uh, this shit here. Burping. The knob. I can't say the knob or reset. I'm kind of scared to try this because uh, I don't want to throw it away and waste my money, but I don't know. Let's see here. Not bad. It's subtle, more not as powerful tasting as the other one. It's more laid back and more subtle. It's uh, less intense than the other beer. So it's easy to drink, though. It's not. It's not like IPA, like hoppy and nasty and gross, and disgusting. Man, I ain't bad. I kind of like it though. It's not, it's not, I've had a lot worse. First time I ever had that shit. Yeah. At least it's not. Wisconsin shit, Wisconsin beer. Anything that comes out of there sucks. Ganset.com. This is different. They also got German beer, I think, where I went. Uh, went a couple places to try to find some stuff. I was trying to find the PBR. Perhaps the lure of an extra strength PBR beer, but I, to no avail, I couldn't find it. But, uh, oh, it was SOL. Uh, so I was going to show you my chopping skills. Uh, watch. Uh, watch and take some notes here. I ain't bragging. I ain't saying I'm the best in the land or, you know, I'm not no expert pro, but I know some shit. Let's just say that. So we got food here. Let's see here. You can call it like this. Like that. There you go. Thanks for watching my chopping skills. I mean, yeah, I'm pretty fast with the knife. I could do some tricks and do some fancy shit with um, cucumbers. Uh, I know a little bit. I've been around for a little while. I know a little bit, but uh, I ain't saying I know everything, but I know a little bit. I ain't here to show off, but I know a little bit. I can show you guys, if you're interested, I can teach you guys some things, culinary and kitchen shit you want. It's up to you guys. I know my way around the kitchen. I know. I got some skills. That's all I'm going to say. But, uh, shit. Look at that one. Man. Man, oh man. That's a good, that's a fucking big one there. Fucking good one. Look at that. Man. Tastes good. 
Well, thanks for watching this video, these two videos. I'll be back again. Count on that. Bank on that. Later, Gators.